Hi guys, that Red Panda here again today, and the Turtle Update 9 update has came out in the UK for Xbox on a, a day early. And in this video, I will be reviewing everything that is new. So I hope you enjoy, and if you did, remember to leave a like. Thanks. My name has been that Red Panda. Right. Okay. So the first thing we have is now Never Brick slabs included, and all of the uh, different types of uh, coloured wood, birch, spruce and um, normal wood. We have the stairs, uh, the slabs and all that. We now have a new, a new texture for gravel which looks much better. Item frames now, you can put anything inside them like at all. But you can even change them around. Um, fire charges uh, Fire charges, lava buckets, water buckets can now be dispensed from a dispenser and the item itself will come out. So, let me just get a block ready here. With a jug, get out of the way. As you see, it spawns lava and I need to patch that quickly. Okay, um, this one will spawn water. And then the bucket's left in there, by the way. This will shoot a fire charge that are newly added. They are in there. There's a fire charge, useful for setting things on fire. Yep. You can spam them. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to use too much of them. Spawn eggs have been added. All of these. Spawn cave spider, everything. And if you dispense them from a dispenser, they will spawn the mob. I'll just show you a couple of examples. Zombie, spider, maybe not a creeper, that might be a bad idea. Uh, squid, I want to put some derpy squid in there. There we go, spam that. There's a squid, skeleton, spider, there. Uh, okay, that was a bit weird. But I need to kill them because they're in the way. So, die, 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 die. Die, die, die. Um, never rat can now be smelted to make never bricks. So if I show you here, put something in to smelt it and it will smelt into, ignore that I have one there, the nether brick and four of these can be made into like the stuff you find in nether fortresses then, vines are now climbable, We. um, if you take some shears and you shear some sh sheep, they will now eat the grass and regrow their wool, like you just saw there. Um, I don't know how often they do that, but it's a great new way of farming for sheep. Um, nether wart grows in the overworld now, as you can see that one at the back has grown. Beaches have been added into the terrain, spawning. Chests are now in blacksmiths, I will show you um, blacksmiths. Um, slime in the way. So if you go in here, get out of the way. There'll be a chest here and it'll be full of random stuff like that. Um, and the main thing that has been added, there's not much, it's kind of like fixes, but yeah, you can see that. There's a sheep trying to get in and the end has been added. So let me just get myself a bit prepared quickly. I'll just get some enchantments down. Uh, yep. Okay. Ah, oh, I'm over. Okay, so we're in the end. <laughs> I'm just I'm gonna enchant now because it's. I want to get. I want to kill him quickly. I have killed him sometime. Um. As you can probably, you, you maybe can hear. There's new music for the end. That. There was the dragon. Um, there's new music in the end that the PC doesn't have, I believe, but done by C418. It's really good with music, I could say. There's a weird noise. There's like it's the end dragon's kind of buggy, but he's got some new movements and stuff, and you can hear him in the background. He's probably right behind me. But um, just get flame on a bow. That's really what I want to get on the end of dragon. Then. Um, yeah. Okay, and we'll just. You can fall out the world as well, by the way. And yep, here we are. There he is. Ender Dragon. In there. 
Minecraft Xbox. Um, the taller pillars now have iron bars around them. You can just hit them, and you can just, you know, fire an arrow at them. And that's a good shot. And just to hit them with them, you need to do that to take them all out. Hopefully that hits. That didn't hit. I'm so bad. Look at me. I'm a noob. My flame arrow. There we go, got that one. Oh god, he's mad. Nah, uh, uh. Yep, right, okay, that hit. Um, he has got none left, so I'm just gonna kill him now. This might take a while, and I'm probably gonna fast forward it. Come here, you end dragon. Oh god, yeah, he fires fire charges at you as well. I'll just have to kill him quickly. This will only take a minute. Oh, there's also this pedestal here. And he gets stuck on it a lot. I think I won't. No, actually, I won't fast forward this bit. Um, the, the, he breathes these new particles and they are Enderman, apparently. But yeah, they're Enderman, as usual. I just hit him with an arrow with my flame bow and you're not even meant to, okay. If he dives down here again. He shoots fire, purple fire charges at you. Um, which is kind of cool. I like the way they did that. I'm gonna try and get him to get stuck on this pole again. As you can hear, the music in the background is changed from the PC, which is good. Which is good. I'm just, ugh, I'm so bad. It's very like calm. What if I would have some epic box music and stuff? Yeah, go and dive into that. Oh, he's such an idiot. Okay. Found a trigger. Come on, in the red bar. It's got an awesome dying animation, I'm not even joking. That's how he got out. Did some good damage there, though. Oh, I hit him with that arrow. That was cool. He's a bit derpy, but it's good that they've finally got this into the game. I think bows actually do a lot more damage than swords do. Except obviously swords you can swing quicker. Yeah, go on, dive bomb into that again. Good, good job. Yeah, they need to fix this. This is a big glitch. It's easy to kill him now. Oh, and he's dead. <laughs> he dies. A lot of XP comes down, as you can see my level now. Yeah, that is a lot of XP. I'm like level level 70, 72, and oh, dragon egg. So same rules apply for the dragon egg. You can get it down with a piston to get it in your hand. It's not in the creative menu, I don't think. But I'm just gonna get it down for you guys. I think you can also hit it with your hand, but ugh, I couldn't be bothered. And then you put a lever. That pushes it, and... Well, it was there, but it just vanished. It was there for a split second, but it just vanished. Wow. Okay. Well, you, you can get it. But, now when you fall into here, the credits play. And I think they're the same as, you know, the PC version. But, it's, yeah, it's all the same. You click B, you respawn back in here where it rains. Um, just to prove, never warts have grown. Sheep, that sheep has eaten grass. As you can see, the grass below them has turned to dirt. Um... I don't think there's um, any more, but um, let me check what's new. 
Yeah, look, title update 9, added the end, added climbable vines, new gravel, all of this, you can just see it. Added smoother colour transition. Oh, and uh, another thing, the nether, the nether, the nether has new music. I'll build a portal quickly. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Uh, 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 flint and steel, flint and steel, where's flint and steel under? Okay. Go to the never, it's got this really quiet music, but it's very eerie and gloomy. It kind of just makes you feel like dead, really. It's quite, it's quite freaky if you were playing on your own, probably. But yeah, I know. It's very, it's very dull. But still, the the Nether has music, which makes it sound all the more better. Oh, and also now, if you were to exit and save. Yes, there is a reset never button when you go to click your world, so you can reset the nether. I don't know why I said it like that. You can reset the nether. So if I go play game, new world, then it's under options, I think. Reset nether, there we go. When enabled, the nether world will be regenerated. This is useful if you have an older save where nether fortresses were not present. So if you click that and then load it back up. Uh, it will give you a brief warning message. Do you want to reset your nether? You just click yes, you can reset your nether. And if you leave that ticked, it will ask you that every time. And you can just say, you know, don't respawn it and everything. But I think, I think that is everything. Other than a couple of fixes with lighting and stuff. I mean, now, yeah, look, there's a new nether. I just blew up TNT here. And there would have been a hole right next to the portal. And it's not there anymore, so that's good. Yeah, there's a reset nether button. Um, I don't think there's anything else. You can spawn like everything. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna spawn everything because you know why not? You know we'll have a party. It's title update nine. Come on now, we all have to party. Why not? Why, not? Why are we not partying? Let's go. Yeah! Party in the house! Oh, there's one thing I have to check actually. I haven't checked it yet. Iron Golems, are they in the game? No, oh, okay. There's no Iron Golems yet. But yeah, you can party around with these guys. You can put them in dispensers and stuff. Or some ghasts, you know. A real party. If I was to attack one of these, I wonder if they would aggro. Yeah, why not? Oh, you're not all gonna aggro. Are you? Oh, that's so no. Oh, that's so loud. See what they mean by they have. Um, they also decrease the sound that they make. I accidentally just killed one. But yeah, you can now party along with these animals with spawn eggs now. I mean, look at them. Such a fun party! Party! Yeah! Party! Fun everything! But yeah, no, that's that's title update 9. We, you, The UK has got it a day early. I don't know why. It completely puts off my video from yesterday on the release date when they said but for some reason we woke up and apparently apparently don't don't kill me if it's wrong but apparently my friend told me that only the UK have it today on Thursday so yeah I uh, like you I like uh, to thank you guys for watching and leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed the video for early Minecraft title update 9 stuff thank you guys for watching and make sure to subscribe for more goodbye